Hi guys, welcome back to Andy's Vintage Guitars. I'm Andy and today I've got a 65 Precision Bass that has been refinished. So I would like to go through a couple of things uh, regarding refinished basses. When I buy these things, I normally check. First of all is the neck pocket, the pickup pocket and inside the control plate to make sure that you've got the original finish okay so you'll know which finish it was there'll be marks in the 60s and 70s that will tell you who made it and you know like some stamps and things so you're always going to check these things like in this case i found the original um fiesta red so that told me that this was the real deal okay and then another things you want to check is the solder joints so solder joints of course when is uh, refinished um it's 99.9 percent .9 you will have to snap the pots and remove the attach the pickups from the pots especially in the early days because later on the route was open so you could take the pick out off and the whole things will come with it but in the early days that routing inside you'll have to disc because of the routing inside you'll have to disconnect it um so these are the things i normally check um and then yeah that's about it uh, some, sometimes you can have a look in, in, at the back of the neck if there's some residue um some leftovers from the previous paint job um uh, but yeah that's that's pretty much it so there's always a good things and the early days also have a pretty cool thing so you can see here it's not regular it's not smooth because the routing machine couldn't do that angle it was too steep um so yeah that's another thing you might want to you know check if you buy a vintage uh pre-68 precision or you know any fender out there make sure they have this bump over there no bump no good let's give this thing a play Thank you very much and this is it from Andy and the 65 P Base. I hope you enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll be back with more content. Thank you.